It's Isaac, isn't it? Isaac's electrical, so... You do better with us than being stuck here with these folks. Come on. And don't go running off with them. Oh, yeah. No, 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 no. No! You're right. Get up, get up, get up. Kira, kira, hi, I. Greetings and welcome. I am Guru. We are back in Trucker County with the fortress playing the No Man's Land mod. Holy heck, how's that? Walking straight outside my base. Straight from the get-go. Holy heck. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Greetings. We are in the barricaded strip mall. We have made some success in the past. Managing to get in here. Push the zombies out of our immediate area. Set up some new enclaves. And ponder our next move. Now, we were looking at taking on the Burro Gordo restaurant. Uh, that is the plague heart, which is fueling the plague. But, but, and this is a big but. We managed to finally build a solar array. And this is the one time I'm glad I don't have a guard tower up to provoke those four. So, few Bit of extra bonus there. These guys are moving in. Yeah. Um, but we've got another plan, folks. Got another plan. This play cart here, I believe, is the only play cart covering the Sasa Regional Hospital. So what I'm thinking is, if we take this play cart out, I can outpost Sasa Regional Hospital... That will give us an outpost up on the plateau against the Alpha Bloods, uh, as well as giving me the phenomenal benefits that you get from the regional hospital, which I think is bonus health and kind of biology stuff. Um, but it has been a long time, so I'm not 100% sure. Um, we have had another m mystery broadcast uh, just turn up, which is right in the area. So you know what? That's what we're going to target. So straight to our vehicle and down to have a look. How we're doing? We've got everything we need there. How's our ammo? Not the best in the world. Have we got any more light bolts? No, we don't. And at the moment, we've just got to be careful because we have vicious rumors out, which is higher influence cost radio requests, but influence prices for buying and performing actions. So even with this run, we will get less influence for doing it. But that's not really why we're doing it. We're doing it to one, buy a bit of time. Uh, and do something constructive whilst the uh, uh, whilst we wait for daylight to come up. Because as we haven't been near, near that heart that we're looking at taking out, well, maxing out on that already, that's awesome. Um, which one shall we take? We'll take this car because it's fast and a little bit quieter. And um, uh, yes, yeah, so we don't really want to go in completely blind straight off the off I want to go down there and check it out especially holy crap um, <laughs> especially as there are enclaves and enclave nearby that we don't necessarily want to get into trouble because they're already pretty hard hit pretty hard and we may need them as we go up against the uh up against the play card itself so still there's a lot going on down here oh boy all right so there's an infestation we'll just park up on the hill for now where we've got a good good visibility we'll take a, a first aid kit that's for sure and one thing we might start doing actually as suggested or explained to me by someone who does it in their own game in the comments to store you know have a battle wagon which is what i use i use the um i use the utility wagon for attacking play carts because it's uh safety features are awesome however however i don't always stock it with stuff to help me uh continue the assault so often I'm, I'm retreating having said that 
Holy kick. Yeah, I was going to say, having said that. Oh boy. Nope, can't fight, fight him on the cart. That wouldn't be allowed. Alright, there is a screamer somewhere around here. Yeah. Got it? Got it. It wasn't it, though. Oof. Hmm. Do we do it? Do we run? I'm going to save my, save my fuel because we've done what we needed to do. Jeez. And you start the car any slower. Uh, we should have... I need it. I need to find a bit of space where I can check them out. Alright. Uh, there should be this kind of crate down the road. There we go. But we'll go loot that. That'll be full of echo stuff. Which is brilliant. And we'll pile that into the car. No one's seen the moon. You can keep your eye on the moon. It'll tell you how much of the night is left. Especially on a starry night like this one. Alright. Somewhere up here. Oh yeah, that's right. It, uh... It insists on showing you where it is. Handy? Yes. Realistic? No. But that's okay. Not sure if we got stealth or not. Okay, here's hoping we get some crossbow bolts or something. Well, hopefully something a bit better than that, but we'll we'll take crossbow bolts. Let's get this thing open. It'll do. We appreciate your results in this matter. No. All right, more meds. That's that's all good. What was that crossbow that we picked up? Echo one. A fine crossbow. Good for parts too. All right. Have we got stealth yet? No. In fact, we've got zero wits. We're a long way from having any stealth. And chuck this stuff in here. Hold on to that. Okay, well, that was better than a, you know, poke in the eye with a sharp stick. Um, I think we'll head back to base. Yeah, because we've got um, we've got some infestations and siege sites popping up, which are, uh, you know, in of themselves not that much of a problem. Loader Central. Uh, but when you've got packs of four juggernauts wandering around as well, back in back in tip of battle, we've fought off plenty of them. Plenty of juggernauts. But only when we've had choke points at our base. And the strip mall is a little bit more open, so we haven't yet faced down a siege. We've no idea how it might go. How vulnerable we may be. I don't want to lose any characters, that's for sure. Not at this stage. We lost one way back at the beginning. And that was enough for me. No more AI deaths. I thought you popped. Holy crap. Well, 
Let's see what our let's see what we're made of. We'll drag these guys into base. And we'll see how we go. This is a test run. How good are our guys on defense? That cloud is a bad way to die. We'll also take out an infesting horde. Oh, we're out the front. Loader, watch your shots. I don't see him. Has ended. That's that's always a good thing. Talking bad about me. All right. Survey the damage. Reese got a little bit. Chrissy got a little bit. I oh, know it was just Reese that got a little bit. Chrissy already infected. So not so bad. Not so bad. This other stuff in the trunk. Check out. Yeah. All right. I'm going to take that advice and I'm going to put more equipment into my vehicles. Juggernaut. Oh, yeah, hell. always a juggernaut up here. You can keep that crossbow bolt. Plenty more where that came from. And we just converted some food into fuel, which is our economy. You know it. So this survivor that we're using is actually our, our new guy, Isaac, who is our electrician and enabled us to build the uh, solar array, which we've never built before. So that's the first. I'm loving that. And um, we've got plenty of food and whatnot going. Is that working? Is that going? Let's use it boost our food so we're at four a day that'll go up to six all right guys i'm ready to get back in the game solar array even has a facility slot i mean how good is that um that should be all right we shouldn't starve right we are starving well we want we want fuel so we'll take that little we'll take that little chip now one area i do want to check is this place here because i'm pretty sure there's a ruck left in it I think. So we'll just go up and have a quick look. Again, we just want to do relatively... Huh, I was going to say relatively safe, but I'd, there is no such thing. Um, less risky or simple contained missions with limited objectives, which, you know, we either achieve or we don't. Where failure doesn't cost us the earth. Need to take that off because we don't use those. Um, and, you know, low risk, low reward, but better than place is seriously full of zombies. doing something stupid like blundering straight into an infestation. <laughs> Yep, there they are. But this, I think we are... Oh, that's that's a nasty split. Fire in the hole! 
Here we go. So, does this actually have anything? No, it is pre-looted. We have ac we have actually looted it. Weird that it would disappear off my map. In fact, now that I think about it, I think I remember going in there previously. Still, nothing ventured, nothing gained. Took out an infestation, got some influence. And we could actually trade now. I want to take out a screamer instead. Um, right. Little two. Be stationed down there. Um, where's the moon at? Still quite high. There's quite a long way to go in this night, so we might do a trading run. I feel great. The worst is behind me. Excellent. So everyone's out of shot. No one left in the infirmary. So we could do a little trade down there. Are these guys still around? These guys are still around. I just want them to, you know, leave, basically. We haven't traded with those guys in a while, but they haven't been that great. I do like their parts income, though. Got the abandoned. You see, we've really got to start pushing into areas where if we, where, where we invest, we get gains. Not just, you know, blowing up a play cart in the middle of nowhere or um taking out a hostile enclave or anything like that it's actually got to pay off at the moment when we're talking about fuel and gas what is our gas can situation because that that determines a lot okay in terms of stuff we've got to sell sell a choke hmm kind of like where we're at 18 stims so you know we are kind of ready to go for something pretty big if we want to it's a long way to go uh to like visit these guys but they're right here how bad can it be yeah we'll do a quick we'll do a quick supply run with these guys Sell some ultralights. Ooh, the ultralights. Right. Hmm. Trading vehicle. Two more plus capacity. Plus the backpack. So, yep, that. Um... We don't need five of those. There we go. I think they're worth a decent amount, actually. And they'll probably stack in the vehicle. Eh, it'll do. Take that out for now. We'll grab... Because we've got loads of suppressors as well. This is the thing with infestations. The, uh, the additional freaks drop a ton of them, so, you know. Let's get some food before they eat each other. There's plenty of stuff. Plenty of those to sell. I'll be fine for food. We've got a problem here that needs attention right now. Really? Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Is this... One of the hostiles? It is. Okay. That we're actually going to do, because I want to get hostiles off the map. I don't think we'll be able to get in there and actually, you know, take out any 
uh, recover any equipment or anything like that. Hey. Hey there. Come on. Hi. The zombies only care for us. Still, can't help but feel as uh, part of the reason. All right, let's try it. Help each other out. Okay. And I got some forty-five. Nowhere for that to go. How are you? I'm looking to do some trading. Yeah, sure. Bill press. Pretty sure we've already got one of those. Hey, yo! Got anything useful you're looking to unload? Yeah, sure. Hey, how's it going? Later. Good. Right. Hey, yo. Let's haggle. Cool. Sounds Let's good. see. Okay. Okay. So, we've got some ammo, some 45. Um, which, yeah, we'll, we'll buy that. Um, we will buy a wooden bat because it costs 22, but we can salvage it for 35 parts or I think it's 50 parts with the salvage furnace, maybe even more. So we'll take that. And we will take the carpentry supplies because we do have an ongoing issue with losing tons of materials. Plus it'll give him a little bit of standing if he chucks it in as well. So that's all good. Be prepared. Alright, let's head back. It's getting pretty tired. Quite a lot tired actually. Quite a lot starved as well. But that's alright, that will only be temporary. As soon as the new day dawns, I think it's as soon as the new day dawns, close enough, we'll get the food bonus. Which is plus seven. So we'll get half of that, so three and a half, which will be enough. Okay. Being as he's tired, he may as well repair the vehicle. So, all right, let's take that's a lot of stuff. A couple of those. Let's take three of those, and let's take three of those and three of those, and put them in the trunk. This doesn't mean we have to use them. A repair kit and chuck a gas can in. There we go. All right. Sun's nearly up, so I think we're almost ready to go in. Oh, look at that. Ooh, we. Juicy. Okay. Swap out. And she shall get the Soviet PPA stage or an AK-47. It's hard to it's hard to go past an AK-47 to be honest. Or an AR-15. They're both pretty good. Or the BAR. BAR with a break on it. There we go. That's what we're going with. Sweet. Alright, so, 
Who's usually first in against the heart? It's Reese. But not today. Today it's going to be Caleb. And we'll put I don't think I'm going to get better without help. Isaac into help. And let's load up. Okay, so we know we want our beetle mallet. It's already been fixed up, so that's fantastic. We only have 364 parts, so we have to be a little bit careful. We go with the Echo 3. That is our go-to. We'll go with this sleeper cell PPK. Grab that, grab that. Grab two of those. Oh, really? Already? Bollocks. Is that because we're starving? All right, then. What if we're not starving? What about now? Nope, still starving. Really don't like that. Okay. No beetle mallet for you. We'll go in with a shovel. Or a double bit axe. With the shovel. Little unfortunate that, hey... We've got to, got to adjust. And we'll go with a bit of fire. And... A bit more fire. Where's our fuel situation? We're static on fuel, which is good. Let's get some morale going. Have we got primary care up and running? We do for another 44 minutes My way. while we're at it. Send any mines at the Arnold Gun Shop. It's good. But that's all. Okay. That's all we need. Right. Jeez, the Trumple... The Trumple trailer, Trader just never turns up when you actually want them to turn up. Tell you what. We went with one of these. And ditch that. And went with the beetle mallet. There we go. And what could we carry apart from that? I need help. They're always asking for help. It's not going to happen. All right, what we're going to do is do a quick drive down to these guys to get them killed. Um, we'll probably wake up, wake up, but we'll do it. And then onwards, onwards to smash the heart. Let's go. Plenty of gas. By the time we get there, the sun will be well and truly up. Holy heck. This way, gents. Gentlemen. Yeah. Those could be brutal if they find their way into our base. Got to make sure we keep some uh, keep some grenades and pipe bombs and the like in storage. I think we've got a few remote remote mines and stuff. So when we go up against this play card after we've um, kind of triggered this mission, this mysterious broadcast, there's going to be a lot of out for blood zombies running around. Now it's right on the edge of the uh, right on the edge of the territory for those, but they will be drawn in by the noise. So it'll be interesting to see just how impactful they are on the whole enterprise. If I take out the nearest plague heart, this should clear up. It might turn out that in a plague heart environment where I'm wailing on it with a beetle mallet, their out for bloodness doesn't really count for much. However, what I'm expecting is that it will indeed count quite significantly. Hey there. We've got an offer for you if you'd like to hear it. All right, so there's somewhere in here, right? No. We've gone somewhere we shouldn't. Feels like that's exactly what we've done. 61 days in, folks. 
Oh, is it them in the shed? It's them in the shed. Whoops. Wow, all bets are off. We might be able to take these guys out. Oh, are they dead already? No survivors at all? Nope. Yeah, that sounds all juggy. Nope. That's fine. We might come back later. Who knows? But we're not going to get distracted from our primary task. I got better. Need the alternative. So that's our friendly house. And the next house is the not so friendly house. Oh, nice. The one with the walls. How many ferals is that? Just the one. It hey, wasn't that quick. That's heavy. Ow. Very slashy. Ha. Beep. Fire the hole. Damn. I didn't mean to hit the fear. It seems like we did. Get at it. Getting low on that. Oh, uh, mid swingy got a bite in. Feels like this isn't a good angle. I think they do extra damage too, don't they? Feels like I'm maybe stuck. I'm stuck. I saw the juggernaut. This isn't great. Can I jump? doing that. Oh, 
Might as well hang out here. How can I be out of Marcian Stim already? Slow him down a bit. For key. Alright, well, hasn't this come in handy? Yeah, it's. Overloaded. Unbelievable. Well, we got some hits in. The stuck didn't help. Juggernauts tend to draw them in like that. Do you see me? Oh shit, he did. Good. Can't do it. Wow, this area is just horrible. Just fighting. Can barely maneuver. Holy shit! Phasing! I'm on fire! Running, 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 running. That was unexpected. You shit. Don't get caught. They're all leapy and divey. It's not good. Alright. Get those ones off me. Fine, mate. Fine. God's sake. Left. 
<laughs> oh no! If I get stuck again, that would be terrible. Oh, that was a complete failure. Gotta watch out for ferals because we haven't got any fire left. Not what I meant to do. Maybe I'm over complicating things here. Can't even swing the executions. Even when I'm dodging, it's doing weird stuff. Did they die? I'll take it. Armored zombies, eh? They drop loot. They can actually drop some pretty good stuff. Now it's important we take this one out because so I need to know about that hospital. We're good, we're good. We're still in there. That's going to get me killed. I would love a sign that said Eden. Ooh, what happened there? Good. Ooh, okay, ouch. Good, we're done. Nothing gets past this dude. Alright, calling that a victory. But there's no yeah, we do. We just need to get back and get this guy. <laughs> Let him have a lie down, we'll grab a fresh survivor, get in there. Shotgun shells? Surely we got some more. I have been going through them pretty pretty heinously though. Yeah. Got a horde in the it's a juggy. Much 
Oh, we got him. Oh, good. Oh, sneaky. They can climb up there. Did he bring? No one, they were all dead. Great. Okay. Ammo situation is 14. That's not terrible. Um, actually, that was a pretty decent hand weapon that he had. We'll go with AK-47 and put a choke on it. Why not? Ah. I put a choke on that. We're all good. Okay. We need another tank. Captain Fantastic. All right. So, I've only got 29 shots with a shotgun, which is not great. So probably 30 all up once it's loaded, once it's loaded, all of that sort of thing. So let's get them prepared. Right. We'll repair that. We'll take going far with all this. a couple of those. Try not to go through them quite as fast this time, maybe. Um. Yeah, I thought we had a pull press. Yeah, we're going to need more shotgun shells, so we'll... We've got the filling machine in there for now, so we will actually make some more craft fuel bombs. Nice. Then we'll get rid of that. We'll put in our shotgun ammo press. And we'll make some more fuel. We should be doing alright out of these. Excellent. <sighs> hmm. Alright. Um Get some ammo. Three, two, three. All of that. And then probably. I can barely lift this. No, nah, we won't go with those. Stay noisy or we can stay safe. Yeah, loads of those. Why not? All right, sounds noisy out front. It's not too bad. Maybe running a little low on gas. Yeah, so much, yeah, those extra supplies, I just chewed them up. That's why I don't put them in there. It's because I just, if I think I have them, I use them. If I don't have them, I'm more conservative or at least a little more careful circumspect about using them rather than just kind of charging on in but we've got first aid kits there they're probably what we need the most all right uh, we aren't going to cheap out on the on the stims because that will that will get us into all sorts of trouble in this area with with the out to blood zombies who to be honest haven't been that bad i'm wondering if they're wigging out a little bit because we're right on the edge of the um yeah right on the edge of the whoops territory for them
Who repaired this window? Just keep wailing on it, I think. Ah, you see? The movement wigs out and I get bit. Just gonna have to manage it without executes, I think. Still, the idea of having maximum pathology and the hospital sounds great. Look at him go! Bam! 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 Ow! It's a dicey area. For movement, for swinging. It's very dodgy in here. Very dodgy. Snailed up on the bed, get snailed up on the furniture. Bazin! Shitty, shitty. All right. I'm actually leaning back in my chair trying to get away from them. It's a visceral experience, folks. It really is. Look at him go. Yeah. We're heading back to base because we don't want to spend the plague cure on getting me fixed up. Not much in the way of permanent injuries with all those bites and stuff, so that's fantastic. So we can go straight back in. But a cheap repair is better than an expensive repair any day of the week. The value of taking out this plague cart, I wager, will be being able to outpost the, the hospital. And that's got to be worth it. We're going to have to... Oh, we missed. How disappointing. I deserve that. I deserve that. That was idiotic. There's a whole point I came back and I muffed it. You jerk. Why don't I feel like a, a right nonce? Yeah, that was, that was beyond done. You may laugh. You may laugh at me. I give you permission. I don't even need to. <sighs> All right. Hmm. Nobody make fun of me for being mushy, but this here feels right. Okay. Uh, yeah, we'll take a bit more. More of those. And we'll take the energy drinks because if we can get... I guess if we use a stim, we'll still call it a win, right? Because we would have used six, which is a bit much. But we're getting the job done. That was such a dumb thing to do, though. Wasn't it? Drive 
reverse back through this the screamish bit you see that's where that's where your desire for vengeance and hatred can take you in this game that plague heart can't be far away holy I I crap I hope those guys stay away make sure they do we'll go up here Oh, hello. All right, what are we dealing with? A clay feral. A lot of creeps are on us right now. Help anyone. Don't go for the head. Dun, 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 dun. Wait. Gotta make sure it's dead. Oh, we could kind of stealth it in. Now, he screamed over there. Which means that'll give us enough chance. He will distract his friends. Backfire, buddy. Backfire. Close encounter. Yeah, pop in the stint. See that? That works. That time. Keep swinging. Keep swinging. Keeps pausing. Are quite tricky. Very hard to tell the live ones from the dead ones in here. Wow, that guy came flying in. Keep going. Combination of yeeting and smashing the plague heart. Oh, I don't like that. That's about the worst thing that can happen to us. Gotta keep at it. Jeez, I'm right here and you're still screaming. Yes! Ah! Now we can start claiming nearby places for ourselves. That's a plan. Didn't I pop one of those? God, I'm tired. Didn't seem to work, did it? Okay. Not 
for which mysterious broadcast that was, to be honest. Back to base and survey the scene. We have a heart to loot, and I suspect a hospital we can outpost. Dang, screamers. Which one? I knew too much time with the damn zombies would make me sick. Not the one we care about, so that's all right. That keep us a little while. All right, let's get inside. things first we need some shotgun shells we're completely overrun we need help now who's that All right. i guess we're not completely fucked oh those guys um we could drive up there with what we've got to be honest as long as we don't stick around should be fine but let's look at the map and the hospital is freaking clear You're folks okay? all right so plan is get up there that's withering that's fantastic make that l clearing out the uh, gazebo house and looting that a lot easier we'll get up here we'll trigger their death then we'll get up here and we'll outpost uh, the hospital. I'm not sure if I've ever done that. I probably have, I just can't remember. Would have been a while ago, though. Would have been a while ago. Guys, the menu around here is getting real short. We need more food. Ah, you're fine. Alright, we'll take that. And... Moving on. So this means we've uh, killed 27 play cards. We're all good. 27 play cards. So that's only 49 to go. So things are moving along. Tell you what, if these do turn into sieges, that could be prob problematic. So what we'll do is we'll go up here, we'll do this mysterious broadcast bizzo. I mean, it's a dangerous area to go up. We'll wake up another play card, but to be honest, there's so many hordes on the map these days, it hardly makes, hardly makes any difference. Um, then we'll go clear the... Then we'll go outpost the hospital. And then we might come back down, if we've still got time, in this episode clear out the infestation and siege sites around home. Why I'm doing this now is because it's daylight. They're inside with us! <laughs> oh god! I'm hurt real bad! I see somebody in trouble over there. Um, I'm trying to get him off. Uh, are they still there? They are mostly gone. Why did I get out? You gotta wonder that, eh? Oh, Christ, the zombies are all over our outpost.
I don't know why they all got so leapy all of a sudden. Ow! Oh shit. Oh, that's one of them there, isn't it? Not giving up. I feel like passing out. I don't even know what we're trying to do here. Looks quiet for now, but as long as that play card is nearby, this place won't ever feel safe. Might have some materials in it. I don't often get much chance to uh, search this kind of area. Jeez, this is just annoying, isn't it? get something for my hassle. Maybe we can trade this to someone. Not that it matters because my equipment is full. Oh well, screw it. Zombies in all directions. Better be careful. All right, let's just get out of there. Lesson learned. Exactly what lesson is, I, I can't quite fathom at the moment, but I guess. Yeah, I guess we took on an element of extra risk there for abandoning the mission. I mean, what would be the worst thing that would happen? What I didn't do, folks, was make a, uh, a sensible assessment of the risk-reward situation. Now, we're hurt and plagued. Smart thing would be to swap out. But you know what? We are going to do that. Because we've got the wrong... We've got the wrong loadout for what we're trying to do here anyway. Okay. Sunny, you're up. We actually want the crossbow for this. At myself checked out, might not. 
not be a bad idea. Some of that. Take some of that. Okay. On would we go? Oh, what's this? Rare skills trader. What could he have that I might want? Oh, we never even got to the lost. The Lost Platoon. They were lost. We never found them. So what have we got today? Yeah, what okay. you got? Scrum. Yeah, that is actually pretty good. Um, but we're not going to blow 1500 on any of that stuff. Scrum's excellent, and yeah, yeah, it gives you the plus two labor, but it's something like 200%. Uh, additional uh, facility speed action. So not just building, but anything that you're doing. So if you combine that, say, with um, a great amount of food and converting that to fuel, that's something which could be worth doing. We don't have any blank, blank slates or, or gaps in our community. But as we've established, I am allowed to um, move a full strength survivor in my community to my legacy pool and then recruit from someone else in the game. I just dropped off a couple things I found while I was out. Yeah, good work. Doesn't feel like we've got primary care going anymore. Just me, or there's suddenly a lot more hordes. Like the game's angry at me, or something. Don't know why it would be. All right, we'll take the uh, we'll take the shortcut, and hopefully this won't get us killed. Is that even going to make it up here? No. Alright. Never mind. It's all good. We'll get up there. We'll outpost it. We'll get all the fuel we need. This is a very, very dangerous area. And that's why I'm spending daylight doing this, because it's a very important part of our strategy. I think the hospital will give us a big health health boost. I think it gives you resistance bonus as well. I'm, I'm guessing it's going to be like a infirmary type kind of buff. to see how out of control it is around here. Plus three food again. Nice. Keep it up. Plus two ammo. That's always good. Alright. We're going to have to fight, that's for sure. And I always seem to run into juggernauts when I'm up here, so we shall be prepared.
Holy crap. Alright, let's get away from the vehicle. And let's get to clearing this place out. Hmm. Hmm. Jeepers, creepers. Not good. Zombies, man. Holy cow. This kind of a room it does. Explored six. I'm just searching all of them. Seven. And this is just a hallway, right? Seem to count. Dear God, I'm tired. Here's the tenth. Pretty sure I was over here, right? Found a few more of them. All right, landmark. Oh, oh how much is it though? Site not secure. And how much is it? Thousand. Fucking know I was here. Let's make this mag count, kiddos. Let's make this mag count, kiddos. All right, so we need a perimeter check. Don't. Yes, he does. Where are all these guys coming from? I gotta rest a sec. Come on, it's it's got to be clear, right? Far out. Hmm. 
Just a thought. Perhaps down here. Doesn't look like it though, does it? Creepers, creepers. Let's make this mag count, kiddos. This is ridiculous. like 28 days later or something don't really have an answer to this Dude, I'm so glad you were here. About damn time. Is that it? How long has that guy been lying there? Ignoring me. All right, need a better look. Come on, Hernandez. You're obviously better at this than I am. Useful stuff. You think they've got something to do with it? that'll catch him on fire. There we go. Not exactly catching though. Fuck, oh I knew that would happen. We can take him. Possibly. Possibly not. All right. Last mag in. Oh, I don't want to 
to jinx it, but I think I just found the perfect outpost. Did that just say secure? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Running, 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 crouching, running, sprinty, sprinty, runny. Let's get it, get it, get it. Consider this outpost done. Uh of course maximum health. Catching blood plague. Um urgent cure. No. Boost maximum health. We'll go with that. Yeesh. I see a plague bloater. There we go. If I take out the nearest plague heart, this might just clear up. Nice. That was looking very, very, uh, shaky there for a moment. Very sketchy, that's the word. Sketchy. All right, last mag in. All right, well. Let's clear this out. Well, we should be safe now. So, Blech, boring. Bandages, how exciting! Let's hit the road. We're done here. Stand mixer. Ah. All right, and that. I'm gonna need a lighter load soon. Now, here's a question: Can we drop a deposit of rucksack? We sure can. Brilliant. Drop this other stuff while we're here. Okay. Okay. Alright. I think this is an area you need to have some fire on you. Just to operate in. Nice. So, look at that. Boom. Where does this guy want to go? To that place. Dude, I tell you, that's keen. I mean, that's that's really keen. Um, let's get a can of gas and chuck it in there. Can't just leave him out in the middle of nowhere. That wouldn't be. That wouldn't be very What's nice. Up? Pretty, it's pretty handy. But we also have a plague heart to loot as well. Can we do both? Jump in, buddy. Well, the car's not sounding great. And the way that I'm driving is not great. Give it some gas, will you? Yeah, hang on, mate. This is not something you want to screw up. If you get stuck up here, we're dead meat. Alright, so yeah, these out for blood zombies are something else. Um, but we can actually get access to them. Good luck with that, mate. We all have our battles we need to fight. Might come back, he may have been successful. But somehow I doubt it. Hey guys, siege underway right now. We need reinforcements. 
Oh, really? Shit, they're in real trouble. And who is that? Them. Whoever they are. I guess if I smash a window, I'll alert the world. Nothing to find here. All right, we'll take those, those, and those. I guess that'll do for now. Come back for the other stuff some other time. Place to put that. It is true. Maybe we, uh, maybe we just. No place to put that. Oh, we're already carrying an eight pack. Okay. Um. Yeah. They're just crazy, those guys. Absolutely crazy. Alright, I think we want to... We want to take stock, get back to base. Drop the stuff off. Be ready for a siege. Or reminisce. We called him Pastor Will. I can't even remember his last name anymore, but I'll never forget what he meant to us. Well, that's nice. The network might be the best thing that could happen to us. I'm home and not dead. My two favorite things. Ow. Anyone? Oh, good shot. The Zeds are trying to take down an outpost, assholes. Which ones? Wow, okay. <laughs> we came home to a burning ring of fire. Yeesh. Okay, got our work cut out for us there. Um, interesting mission, the freak in the house. If we can get there and help them in time, then they're automatically friendly. However, or automatically allied, sorry. However, look where they are. Next to a play cart in the middle of Out for Blood. Um, it's, yeah, it's not going to happen. To try and help them would get us killed. Oh, they took my main armor, my main ammo outpost, which I'm pretty unhappy about and we'll need to go and take out almost immediately but holy heck how we've we been doing we've been going for almost an hour and a half if not slightly more so i think we'll call the episode there we've certainly got our work cut out for us next episode but we have successfully moved ourselves along another play cart down and a new outpost uh presented and let's just let, let's just take a moment it's our only uninfested unfested um outpost hey it gives us two meds a day plus 25 maximum health and it's got a wider safe zone and passive scouting bonus for what it's worth um and we can change that to blood resistance if we do that plus 50 infection resistance i think that's us isn't it because we've already got pretty big health buffs that's awesome. 
Excellent. Yeah, I'm liking that. Um, which means that, yeah, that's the equivalent. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's perfect. That is perfect. And it also gives us a foothold to move into this area. Um, and honestly, if we're going to go for any play card, it has to be that one. Just absolutely freaking has to be. If we take that out, then, you know, all the rules are off. But what I think we'll do for the next episode is take these out, take that out, and then uh, refocus our efforts on getting rid of fueling the plague, smash this area out, loot it out. Hmm. But first things first, the, the enemy on the doorstep who are getting ever closer. Thank you so much for watching. I do appreciate it. Please hit that like on the way out. It really helps me in the channel. Hope to catch you for the next video wherever you are in the world. Go in peace. Kakate. Bye for now.